Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is going to be um, the $20 unit from Hanover. Um, I'm just going to say this to keep track for me. Um, unit number K8. And this is going to be video number four. Um, we're going to be doing some more unboxing um, and show you a few things. Video number three is going to be fun. That um, You've already seen that and you've gotten to see a lot of really cool tools. So, all that being said, I'm going to keep this short because you don't want to look at me when you can look at the pretty girl Kathy. So, um, like, subscribe, um, hit the notifications, and uh, please share. Comment below, let us know how we're doing. Um, if you see anything here that you are interested in perhaps purchasing or whatnot, what have you, um, let me know. Hi folks, uh, this is Kathy again from EB's Plunders and Finds. Uh, getting ready to show you some more finds or plunders. We'll have to wait and see. Um, again, this is from K8. That's to differentiate from the other one, which is A8. So, <laughs> makes it a little bit difficult. Okay, so if you're ready to see things, move it to the... You got it? Yeah, we got a new cameraman, so... Because the last one kind of sucked. But we'll see. <laughs> see how it goes. Uh, Duct tape. Electrical tape, actually. Oh, yeah. Electrical tape. All right. Which will all be clear Ooh. by now if you've watched all the videos. Ew. One slipper. Going in the trash. Oh, we're not going to make had, it. It had trashy stuff on it. I didn't all know All right. It. So it's not going to be a dog toy. Okay. No. No, no, no. Okay. Get this open. Here's another one of those, these weird. We got. Let's pack up everything in a box. Yeah. But okay. We could use Windex. Windex. Just make a nice little comet. Not even opened. We don't use comet that much. I used to use it all the time. Styling gel, frizz control, mouse. Look out. Well, somebody can get that. Mouse, no. What? Come on. Say hi to mouse, folks. Uh, scrubbing bubbles, fantastic bleach five in one. Uh, Rust oleum, painter's touch, extra cover. Uh, somebody can have mouse it. was outside when we were bringing things in, so now that he's in, he wants to uh, sniff everything. Deodorant we do not keep if it's been opened. Um. These little things, diamond dozen, we're not keeping those either. All right, what is this? Ice blue. Probably been opened. Like icy hot? Yes, yes. All right, they can go in. Okay, this looks like it. Oh, it wasn't leaking. Jingle body lotion. It has been used. All right, trash away. Hey, no, he was chewing on that wheel. <laughs> Stop it, boy. Mouse, go. Alrighty. Mouse. Oh, we have oh, one yeah. of these. These are nice. Pyrex. Oh, bowls. boy. Just to demonstrate. Good boy. He does know how to do that. <laughs> All right, back to the uh, unboxing. Two cup. These do. Um, ours has a lid. Lord knows if we'll find a lid in here or not. But um, okay. So just to keep. Corralware. Blue, with ripples. Probably just generic. Uh, a lid. 
don't know. That's going in the trash. Look like that lid had seen better days. Yeah. Bubba, keep it or pitch it? Um, pitch it. Oh, and this one. <laughs> An unopened bottle of tonic water. Oops. But, uh, I think we'll get rid of it because who knows how long this stuff has been in there. <sighs> Should probably dump that first. Later. Alright. Dell some cough medicine. That trash away. Spoon. Salad fork. Other fork. Spider. Two generic wooden spoons. Trash these, keep these. No, they all go to yard sale. Okay. Oh, and here's more of these. I guess they're just plastic serving spoons. Oh, can I see them? Yeah. And that's actually plastic. Cameraman's on point. Oh, and we have a true dental tool I believe nice looks like a dental tool set that aside we'll keep that yeah I'll set it in there um a box of small razor blades I think we saw something that took these okay ah, now see we couldn't go without finding a tool so what you got a drill bit Okay. So, tool. Put that in there. Alright, these are plastics. Another knife. Okay. Or that might not have been this unit that had all the knives. I think it was one before. Uh, old fashioned can opener. I don't know. Anything in that box that's not kitchen? Just kitchen utensil stuff. Well, it's almost empty. Trash, trash. I don't know what this metal is. Don't know. It's just a ready shade. It's a clip. You want to keep it? Nope. Oh, this might be a tool thing. Feels metal. It's just black. You can screw into it. That might be something. All right, another scraper. That's toolish. And from Braun, it is a uh, measuring cup. Keep, sell, I mean, get rid of. Yard sale. Yard sale. Oh, and that's yard sale. That's yard sale. All right, basically, that's trash. So, I'll just pick them up, throw them in the trash. Okay, do you want to pause it until we get to the next one? Okay, is it there? And we're back. Can you read it? Yep, Mammy's Garden. It looks like a nice little homemade um, garden. Get the wheels. Raised bed thing in my bobber, maybe. Oh, this came off. Um, in the process. Needs a little love. But, uh, I think it's cute. Might be good for somebody. So, that's definitely going to the yard sale. And let some industrious soul see if they can't fix it up. Okay. It's going back over here. And All I right. don't know why it came apart. And we're going to kind of rapid fire a few things here. Um, this is the chair. I'm trying to get the back of it. Oh, it's even got a pocket there. Uh, Glenny Bear Bears. Oh, the Bears Den restaurant. Yeah, that's from the bowling alley down here over. Um, we found a bag for that in one of the, in the tool unit, or in the tool. 
video. Okay. And it's a real, it's a big chair. Sorry. So many self-explanatory. Okay. Well, I hope with um, designs, can you? Design. Hula hoop, or as I call it, a belt. Makes noise. We don't know what this goes to. Um, keep it over where you were. I was just going to say. Something obviously sits on this. But. We don't know what. Or unless it goes, no, it wouldn't go under the counter for paper towel. No. No. <laughs> so, so, we well, are in search of whatever that goes to. I didn't find anything that I think would go on it, but. All right. Maybe come up with something for it. Next, we got a couple of uh, wooden shelvy things. And there's a bigger, nicer one, too. But it's not in here. And there's a bigger, nicer one, too. But it's not in here. <laughs> I think that's pretty. Is, wait a second. Um, I think it's just a towel bar, hun. Down. Okay. No, well, but it doesn't come apart, so. Oh, you mean to put towels I'm like in a bathroom, it. a towel bar. Yeah, yeah, okay. And <laughs> it just has this kind, you know, screw it. Yeah. Put it down. Okay. Mouse, no. Mouse, go lay down. Go lay down. It's just for your... Knickknacks. Very pretty. Oh, can you see it all? Um, looks well made. And uh, that'll be going just on the yard sale. Run it out of room. Bag. Uh, next we are, we've got a bag we're going to start going through. So here we go. <laughs> One moment. Start. Brown on one side. There is a design. Wine bottles. It's wine bottles. That's a oh, it's upside down. <laughs> and glasses. There you go. Trust right. me, so it's wine bottles. And glasses. All right. Um. Pork chops, alibi bar, rocks. That's what it says here on the front. Oh, I'm pretty much on the back guys, as well, I guess. Don't know about that. I think this is a shower curtain. Yeah. Just a white shower curtain. There are car uh, curtain rings. I remember seeing them someplace. Um, can't tell if it's tablecloth or curtain. I think it's curtain with um, leafy design. Don't know how big it is. Did you want me to undo it? No. Okay. Blue, be blue pleather. pleather. Mark Buchanan Pele Pele. Didn't we see that? Yeah, I think, I think that might be a good brand. I'll have so, to check it out. Is it oh, it's blue? Is it leather or is it pleather? Um, you should be able to tell by the smell. Leather, I think. We'll be checking the pockets. And all later, I was trying to find a cleaning tag. Oh, it's got the elastic um, waist, but it's just a button arm. It's a nice jacket. Yeah, and looks like maybe it has a uh, snap in liner. Button. Button in liner. Button in liner. Like I said, there should be a cleaning tag, which has been... I would say out. we could put this on Poshmark, but we've got 
A lot of things on Poshmark and nothing <laughs> has ever sold. But they're not that nice. So The stuff we've put on is... is, is not. That's I don't know about these. Wranglers. <laughs> Jean shorts. Um, I've or seen. are they pants that were cut off? I don't know, but they've seen better no, days. No, they're shorts. So what size are we dealing with here? 44 relaxed fit. There are 606 W1DH. Okay. Right. Moving that. along. Yeah. A towel? No. Or a robe? Or a Snuggie? I thought it was a hoodie, but it's not because it's like it, that. There's a tag right there. I'm, yeah, I'm, I was trying to see the bottom. Cuddle duds. <laughs> it's a snuggie. One size. Yeah, but where do you put your arms? Or is this for your feet? Who knows? <laughs> well, it's got that folded part at the top, and then the rest is all just like a blanket. I don't know. And more. Another shower curtain. Okay. Looks like that's and it for that bag. That's it. Pause back in a few. Ready? All right, guys. Here we go. We're back. We just untangled all this so we could show it. We didn't want to do the untangling in front of you, but this is a nice set of jumper cables. A nice um, extension, extension cord. cord. Another extension cord. And these seem to always come in twos in other ones we found. And another set of, ex of uh, jumper cables. Okay, so we'll just leave them there and go right into, is this the last thing we got here? Yeah, I think so. For right now. For now. I mean, we have, we will be keeping one set of the jumper cables. Um, the other one's probably going to go out to the yard sale. Why won't this go down? Push. Okay, I wanted to show you the bottom. These are, mm, this is like a shopping cart. Shopping bag. Push that back. I wanted it flat. S safari scenes. Um, does have a zipper on top. Oh, you probably can't see it. It's kind of neat. By Benjamin Jordan. Okay, so I'm going to set that down to pull out all this stuff that I oh, by the way, jammed into it. Just to give an update on the jacket, which behind me. The uh, Pele Pele or Pele Pele or whatever okay. jacket. Um, we might be doing really well on that. <laughs> I need to do some more research. But those leather jackets are going um, hundreds of dollars on eBay at sold listings. So Ooh. Hopefully by the time we wrap this whole unit up, I'll be able to give you a, an actual what we sold it for. So, moving along, okay. you back to Vanna. <laughs> yeah, in amongst the uh, power cords and chargers was another one of these um, fishing. What do you fishing wire for the electrical? You know, going through your wall and stuff. So, all right. So back to the bag. We have a hooded sweatshirt, your basic blue, oh, I hadn't seen that blue. It's a Nike. Oh, it does have the swoosh on the oh, chest. on the chest. And it's just a basic dirty, but it's kinda dirty sweatshirt. Kind of dirty, worn, beat up. Obviously a work sweatshirt. It's not um, stained, so. Probably go on the, on the yard sale for... A buck or two. Not stained. 
This looks like a woman's, probably. Little hoodie. Uh, medium. Don't know what brand. Couldn't see a brand. Again, just yard sale. Ireland with some Irish symbols. T-shirt. If, if that cleans up, we could send that to Matt. Fruit of the Loom, heavy HD, extra large. He wears a medium. So, gonna have to do some washing. And we did figure out that that one, um, as we were packing it back up, uh, what I thought was a curtain was actually a shower curtain. The one with the leaves with the fancy. So it's like goes on the outside. Just your basic uh, girl shirt. Girls like little cap sleeve. Outlaw brand. Oops. This feels like another shower curtain. 100% polyester. Yeah. Yeah. It's not the same pattern, is it? No. I was thinking the other one. Leaves, but not quite the same. I care of that. Um, got a couple more pieces of clothing. Shorty shorts, arrow pastel. These have got to be kids. <laughs> Don't be so sure. Midi, M-I-D-I. -I. It's on there. It's written on the thing and on the tag, and it's got triple zeros. So, she must be real skinny or else it's kids. I don't know. And then another um, little tank top. Can't read the thing's tag. It's all out. One more. Alright, it's stuck on the hangers. Just a bunch of metal and plastic hangers, which we'll probably just get rid of. And one more shirt that's an uh, arrow, arrow pastel. 87, I think that's a 7. We will have to check that out. Or the 8Z. Extra small stretch. I mean, to me, the shorts look like they're all worn out, but I think that's a style. So we'll have to look. And two more ooh, skirt hangers. We might want to keep them for hanging stuff. So anything else in Eversize hangers? Nope, that's it. All right. Um, we're stopped. We might be back. We might not. Hey, guys. We're back. Hope you guys are all okay. No broken bones or anything because you, you all took a tumble while we were getting ready. Um... Mr. Mouse. Say hi, Mouse. Say you're sorry, Mouse. No, stay. Go back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, go sit down. Go sit down. And they call it go lay down. Love. Go lay down. Good boy. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now, we're going freestyle on this, because as you know, the channel name is EB's Plunders and Finds. Uh, well, we've plundered, and we've plundered some good stuff out of this one, but according to Miss Kathy, and I haven't seen this yet, this is quite a find. So we thought we'd leave you with the find on this one, and... And all that being said, here we go. All right. Basically, we got a twin sheet as a cover-up. <laughs> this is just a cover-up, but it is a um, Home Darta. It's a Darta okay. um, thing. Maybe that other little piece that we saw like this goes in this. I don't recall seeing a cord for this, but... Anyways, that was also for cushioning. I'm not impressed yet. This is for cushioning. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Oh, my. <clears throat> Oops, is it on there? Yeah, be careful. I got it. Hamilton, established 1892. Lancaster County, that's Amish country here in Pennsylvania. Um, you ready? Yeah. I can see that more clearly. It's got the uh, guarantee and instructions, Hamilton wall clocks. Let me see. Hamilton Clock Company says on the back. This obviously is the pendulum that needs hooked up. There are some other things over here. Don't know. The most important thing is, you looking? The key to wind it is in the box. Mouse back. That is really pretty. And I don't know what that is. The glass is really dirty. Yeah, that's why you can see it's and the hand and hands and stuff are in good shape. It was sitting upright like this on the lower deck dresser. So with the side to you, so you really couldn't see what it was. And you want me to lift it for the bottom? It is very, very heavy. No, you don't need to lift it for the bottom. Um, oh, you do want to see what's on the back. And we'll want to see what's on the back. Oh, really? Hamilton wall clock instructions. So it's got the original instructions. Very tiny print. Is there anything on the top? There's a thing to hang it. You would hang it just from that on the wall? No. I don't think so. I don't know what that is. All right. It looks like a, oh, it's just a piece of tape, but it looks like, oh, maybe that other paper looks like it was up here because there's a All right. spot. But oh, this it looks is... like it might be missing this piece. There was like a finial probably oh, piece maybe. there. But it's really pretty. The back is even nice. I don't know. I don't know, you might you need need the key to take the back off or something. Uh, but, yeah. I don't think it's well. it's, a, it's a gorgeous clock. Let me turn it back around. And, uh... People can get it. So that is... A definite find, I think. Yeah, it's a definite find. Um, I imagine it's worth at least 20 bucks. <laughs> oh. Why does that say AT&T? This might have been a prize. Yeah. Or like a retirement award. Yeah. So. But, there you go. And, uh, now that will just, uh, tack this to the end of the other, the rest of the video. And... That's all for us this time. You want to take us out? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment below. I guess that's it. <laughs> I can't think. Oh, I'm just so tired. Yeah, she's she's been busting her hump. Um... I'm grateful Selling. to I'm grateful to have her. I hate myself sometimes for not being much more help. But, you know, we agreed to do this together and we 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 are having fun. Are you having fun? Yes, I'm having fun even giving away all this stuff out of this unit. It was a trip getting, you know, getting all the people there to pick up their stuff. 
The washer and dryer went to one person. The stove and refrigerator went to another. The two dressers went to at the same place to someone. And uh, two different people picked up the um, windows. And we did, we did. And the spool. And we did not give everything away. We did no. sell a few things. We, but we we've got our money back already in pocket for the cost of the unit and then and all the fees. So that's a good thing. Um, now, I don't, is there much more from this unit to go through, hon? Yes. <laughs> Can we get it in one video if we're smart? It might be too long. Well, we're going to try to get it in one video. If not, it'll be two. But, uh, th thanks for watching. And I'll give you another update on the about the furniture in the next one. And uh, I know I showed you a lot of mouse in this video, but he he is our he is our world. We'll close out with him. So hope you guys have a great night. Love on your babies, cause we love on ours. He's and out. Thanks for watching. Until I open the door. <laughs> Be very, very quiet.